and we are live. Hi everyone. Hi, I'm Kushim with Hybrid, and uh, I welcome you to today's live stream. It's uh, what is it? It's Tuesday. It's a really crappy Tuesday for me, at least. Uh, crappy Tuesday, which is let's see, December sixth. Crappy Tuesday, December sixth, two thousand sixteen. Uh, hi everyone, you're watching uh, today's live stream with, uh, on Cryptic Hybrid and I'm going to play Pathologic, uh, the Marble Nest. Now Pathologic is, um, it's a remake actually, it's a reimagining actually, it's, it's a reimagining of a game uh, of the same name uh, from 2005, Pathologic. The game is developed by, developed and published by Icepick uh, Lodge and it has a very interesting story you play well you get to play uh, three, three characters and the idea is that you have to uh, survive for i think 12 in-game days uh, in, in a in a step town um, uh, that has been hit by a mysterious disease so people are infected people have died already and you have to pretty much survive and maybe, maybe, maybe also find out where the heck the disease comes from and maybe find a cure. If not, everybody's going to die. I, I, I guess. I guess that that's going to happen. So now, now Pathologic the Marbleness, the, this, uh, this build that I'm playing right now, it's, uh, it's a slightly separate story. We'll, we'll talk about uh, uh, it more um, uh, very soon. It is a pre-alpha uh, build. So uh, let's just start and we'll talk about it more very soon. And new game! Pathologic the Marblenest is a mood piece created to, ac uh, to acquaint you to the world of, the of Pathologic. It's a self-contained short story that uses the same assets and premise as the main game but works as a spin-off. So it's not, it's not part of the main game but it has the same, uh, uh, it has the same assets and has um, kind of the same goal. In terms of gameplay, the Marbleness doesn't feature every in-game mechanic that you'll find in the real Pathologic and is generally in pre-alpha state. So it's it's new, it doesn't have all the mechanics, but it it will give you a good uh, you know look at, at the game. And we're in! We're in! Uh, this game is powered by Unity, everyone. Again, it's uh, developed and published by... Baddies. Baddies? Gather ye here. Round, round, marble. Okay, so I'm playing a doctor right now. This is my character. Day 1, 2 a.m. Hi, hi Christopher, hello. And these are my stats. Uh, health, uh, I, have, I have health, stamina, immunity, hunger, first fatigue, and infection. And you have to keep all of those, well, your health up, I guess. And your immunity up. And everything else down. Oh, uh, actually, stamina up too. First high too. Fatigue low. Hunger high, oh, sorry, hunger low, I guess, right? And infection low. So, uh, I also have uh, an inventory where I can equip myself with, um, well, apparently I have a heart in my pockets. A heart, a warm heart that uh, went out to people, literally. Uh, use bandage, the traces of the epidemic are omnipresent. Why do I carry this shit around with me? Milk? Antibiotic, immune boosters, okay, those, these are good. Hi, hi, Matt, hello, hi. Hi, bye, I guess. Okay, I also have a map of the world. And here is kind of like my journal. The sand plague has infiltrated the town. The source or carrier has to be around. Where? So I have to find the carrier of the... But first, let's, let's just go and meet this lovely young lady, boy, kind of... Like, can I look around? Like, uh, can I? Oh, I can play the piano? No, no, I can't. Okay, so let's talk to whoever this is. Um, Aspity. Oh, she doesn't look that good, does she? Like, she she looks really pale. And why is one eye like one pupil is very like small and one is really dilated? What's up with that? You are a brave man, doctor. I'm glad to see you finally mustered up the courage to do it. Meaning it's probably time to say goodbye, right? He probably liked it at least, yeah, hopefully. Uh, how am I brave? Time to say goodbye? Why so soon? I'd rather, uh, that's rather unkind of you. My courage never faltered in the first place. Hmm. How am I brave? Well, you are going to die now. Death is awaiting you downstairs by the exit. I wonder if you'll manage to give it the proper answer this time. I'm a doctor, I've been fighting this my whole life, and I usually succeed. 
Hmm. I don't know what is proper dealing when uh, proper when dealing with death. Punching its sorry bony face seems like the best option. Uh, now nah, I'm going to go for the cocky answer. You are a great doctor. There's no denying that. A skilled fighter of death. The plague almost devoured this town, but you managed to protect the stone yard from the infection, creating an impenetrable citadel here. But take a peek outside, and you'll see that people are still dying. Why do you reckon is that? Hmm. Um. I can still fix it. Can you even exit this house? I'm not sure if you can. I usually succeed. I'm not used to defeat. So we're not going to get defeated. Just fix your freaking eyes. <laughs> Jesus. You made a mistake. Fought the wrong enemy. What do I have to do to get through to you? You want to exterminate death, yet to, you drag it behind uh, like a tether ball. That's just not the right way. Hmm. I'm tired of your step poetry. Let me through, please. Farewell, doctor. You were a good man, but your eyes were stitched shut. Go down now. Death is re getting restless. Restless. Evil Saturday, foul Saturday. Any Saturday is followed by a Sunday. It's not over it. I can turn it good still. Hmm. Weird person. Weird short person. Or I'm way too tall. What the hell? Why so many cages? Hmm. Oh, what the hell? Oh, hello, bull. What the hell? Weird cat picture. Hello, bull. What? What? Ah, she closed herself in there. Jesus. Raining outside, it's night. Well, it's 2 a.m. Hi, bull. What, what, what the hell are you doing here? Can't I pass? Hmm, okay. Let's just go, I guess. Let's look around. Because you have to find various objects. Uh, ooh, like this key. Key, it's cold. Uh, you have to find objects, you have to eat, you have to find medicine for yourself and for other people. You can ba uh, barter, you can steal, you can fight in the in the full game at least. Hmm. H-E-T, what's H-E-T? What the hell? What's this girl doing down here? Is she drunk or something? This kind of looks like a hospital, doesn't it? Okay, nothing. So wait, let me let me check the map a little. Um, to my place one, the warrants two, full list three, volunt eleven, four, med stock. Okay, the, I'm guessing that's what I have to do. The warrants full lists. The crucible. Step people here. Okay. What the? Oh, can I go outside? I can't go outside. Alright. Can't go outside, but I can go here. Hello, wait, I'm just going to... Uh, I'm just to rummage through all of here. All, all of... well, everything I can. Come on, nothing I can steal? I want to steal things. No? Nothing? Oh, here? No nothing. Who are you, dude? Orderly number 12. Done. I took them all away. Can't do no more. Took whom away? Everyone. Well, he looks... He, he has a wonky eye, but he looks a bit better. I mean, what about you? How are you feeling? I'm dead tired, doctor. I haven't had a decent sleep for two days now. Any more assignments? We're goners anyway. No chance to break out of here. We did all we could, but this seems to be it. Orderly number 12, going off duty. Hmm. Take a break, number 12. You are released from duty. Just one more thing, Doc. Reckon there is still hope? Hmm. There were 13 districts in your town. Miraculously, I managed to save two. Dozens of refugees are sheltered here. There will be survivors. Hmm. Did uh, you take the sick to the side room? You knit with? I had no proper conditions. It's too small. What? No, I'm just going to tell him that we're fine. 
We're fine, we're fine. Let's go up. Is the girl awake? No, she's not awake yet. Uh, come on, you can sleep. Why is everyone so so not not so tall? Definitely not so tall. I'm I'm taller than everyone, I guess. Oh crap. Uh what's with these bodies here? Uh Are they vampires or something or are they like dead from the plague? Great. Uh dude, oh you just passed out? Oh, I can steal from him the pocket watch. Recently stopped. This means that the original owner has most likely died. Oh, great. Okay. So he's dead. These people are all dead. Great. Oh, what the hell? Oh, you're what? Okay. Oh, you don't look that great. Dora Fugel. Dora Fugel. Everything's done. I got a bit sleepy though. Sorry about that. Shall we proceed with the treatment, Doctor? Hmm, what treatment? Who are we going to treat? Where's everyone? Don't give me that look, Doctor. And don't blame yourself. I think I know why we ended up like this. Your attention must have slipped today. You didn't put, up all, uh, you didn't put all the pieces together. Failed to assemble the puzzle. Hmm, you need to have some rest. If you're, if you're not squeamish, you can take my any bed. You told us yourself, don't you remember? Everything that transpired did so for a very good reason. The puzzle was almost solved, but some pieces must have slipped. Me, I don't even know what events you were referring to. It was your day after all, not mine. Evil Saturday, foul Saturday. Puzzle is not the word I will use. I'm glad you're feeling better, Dora. Now get some rest. Okay, I don't know where she's going to go. Can I get out? Hmm. No? Apparently not yet. Oh. Okay. Oh, hello. What? Can I steal some things from here, maybe? Nothing? Come on, nothing? Really? Okay, who the hell are you? Um, Marat Rannan. Ah, so it's true. You've given up, resigned to die, thrown in the towel, the great bachelor Damkowski. What? A celebrity fanat fanatologist? The scientist who is claimed to have defeated death itself utterly failed, haven't you? Hmm. What makes you think I've resigned to die? I trusted you. We all did. For as long as you lived, so did we. I know it firsthand, and now you've decided you've had enough and marched into the grave meekly, like a lamb to the slaughter. What? No! It must be nice. It must feel nice to find an easy way out. The easy way is shifting all the responsibility from your dumb heads to my shoulders. Stop with the foam at the mouth, or do I need to teach you good composure? What? Oh, I'm actually fighting this guy? Ah, oh, crap. Oh, oh nice, I'm fighting him. Cool. Just go down. Go down. Get away. Just stay down, okay? Stay down. Why is he fighting me? Why am I... Jesus. Why did I do that? Oops. I mean, I hope he's not dead. His head looks like it's detached from his body. Uh, inventory? No. He doesn't have anything on him? Hmm, okay. The bull's still there, at least. Oh, what the fuck are you? What the? Jesus. Oh, and the girl died. She's dead here now, great. Hello, crow dude? The exec the executor. This is it, doctor. You fought valiantly, but you've lost. A foe like me is no match for men, and you are no exception. So, are you ready to die? Hmm. 
No, that is not what I intend to do, exactly. So you didn't understand anything, stubborn man. I've done more than it's human... You've done more than it's humanly possible. You're come down off the safe part of the town, but it was all in vain. I'm here already. I don't believe you, it's... Uh, this is all a dream, a nightmare. Actually, it's, it, it does look like a dream. A prophetic dream, bachelor. Such is the nature of the plague. The town seems clean and calm in the morning, but somewhere in the depths of the of a nondescript house, a carrier is already lurking. Come noon, fleas appear in hordes, transmitting the sickness. So do rats. By the evening, the whole town is in agony. You've seen this many times already. So, are you ready to die? Hmm... No, don't even try. Soon I'll wake up and you'll be gone. No, you may not want me at. Uh, you might not see me at once, but that doesn't mean I won't be there. I'm telling you, I'm already in this part of town. Please understand that resistance is pointless. You need to come to terms with my existence and accept me, like you accept the law of gravity. I am Earth. We are of the same nature. Are you ready to die, bachelor? Hmm. Um. Well, Fred, what, what, whatever this is, if you've infiltrated the stone yard already, all I need to do is find you. As you wish. In that case, go and see for yourself. Be gone, plague. Out of my way. Hmm. It's raining. Well, I'm finally outside. And I can't go back. Because reasons. Oh, I see rats. What? Oh, gee, oh, shit. <laughs> Jesus, that really scared me. What the hell, boy? Sticky. Doctor, wake up! A bad thing happened! Uh, I know the infection found its way here and its carrier must be around, perhaps walking the streets right now. Blackie's old man is ill! But it's not the plague, I mean, not the sand thing. Would you cure him and not send uh, big heads after him? Big heads? Okay. Um. Whether it's the sand thing or not uh, is for me to decide. But well done, lad. Waking up immediately, uh, waking me up immediately. An hour of hesitation could have cost us, uh, cost us the town's life. Also, the judge was here. demanded demanded you be woken up. I stopped him. Didn't like how the old geezer looked at all. Nuts is uh, how he looked. Hands shaking and all. Oh, maybe he's sick. Hmm. Um. Really, sounds. Odd. All right, I'll deal uh, with your blackie first, and then pay a visit to the crucible. And then, then it's then. Okay, so now I have a mission. Let's see. L. Oh, well, sorry. I. Uh, okay, I have, I have a pocket watch and some money, and I have the judge pay me a uh, pay me a visit while I was still asleep, and there's a sick. Person in neck one. Okay, let me look around. Okay, face mask. This is good. Let's take the face mask and used bandage. The trace of the epi no. I'm not going to use it. Get a used bandage. I don't want to die. What's this? Broken ampoule. Uh, people would uh, use any of. Uh, you use any and all means possible to cure themselves of the disease. Okay, I'll take it. And raisins! I'll take the raisins too. Why not? Hmm. Oh, more money, yes. And immune boosters. Okay, I'll take the immune boosters too. Hmm. Okay. What the hell? A bull's head. Hi, Lurch. Hello. Hello. Oh, let's look around here. Uh, beetle, a surprising if useless find find in autumn. Hmm. Okay, I'll, I'll take the beetle and the cracker. Let's take a cracker. No. 
So this is well, this is my place, I guess, my my house, my. There were people here. Hmm. Was this morphine? A person is only alive for as long as they feel pain. Morphine makes you numb uh, to it, seemingly increasing health. Okay, so morphine is good for giving you health. Okay, that's good to know. That is... What the hell is this? Oh, I think this is the... Um, like the silhouette of a, another character. Keep him warm. <laughs> okay, let's go up. up. Let's see if there's anyone... Uh, no? Can't go here. Right? Hello? Oh, this is where I punched the guy. Hmm. Uh, water bottle. Seemingly uh, sates first a bit. Despite the town standing on the river uh, Gorgon, fresh drinking water is a rare commodity here. How are you doing? Any better? Well, uh, not that great actually. Not the best day. Not the best day. I've, I've been... Um, ooh. Ooh, money! It's like a match. Okay, let's get one of some matches. What game is this? This is Pathologic. It's uh, it's uh, a, an early alpha build of Pathologic. It's um, the game is um, a first-person um, open-world survival game where you have to eh, survive, survive for I think 12 in-game um, days. Chris, yeah, I'm I'm powering through. Uh, my throat is just a little bit, but it's it's fine. It's okay. I just uh, I, I I spent a lot of of today trying to record the game uh, and it didn't work. And then I tried other stuff and they didn't work. And then I tried other stuff and they didn't work. And I tried some other things and they worked, but but the audio was shit. So yeah, not so good. Oh, is that death again? What do you want, death? Oh, no, orderly. Also, this is orderly. Oops. Grigory Gorky, number six. Here to report to you, doctor. Um, well, generally the coast is clear, sir. No signs of the plague. So these are orderlies that, that are dressed like this. Hmm. Uh, do you have any um, making... Uh, just, it's just my throat. Probably just a bug. I, I usually have like a pretty sensitive throat. I've been uh, having... Um, well, on and off issues for some time. It's nothing like too bad, but uh, just, you know, more annoying than anything else. Hello, Ifiju, hello. Uh, I'd say we've won. Congratulations are in order. As for us, we are leaving this part of the town. Our place is across the river. Still work to be done there. Wait, 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 wait. While you're leaving, we have death among us. Well, plague among us. You're living nowhere. It's quite the opposite, actually. You're staying here to comb every suspicious nook and cranny. We've missed something, I know it. But most orderlies are gone for good. Some of them gone home even. Come now, doctor, your work is done. Take a look at your take a look at yourself. I've seen happier corpses. You're overworked and deserve a rest. A good, long, peaceful rest. No, I'm going to die if I do that. Hmm. There's no rest for the wicked. Exactly, that's exactly. Yeah. Uh, I never dismissed the orderlies. So why are they gone? Do my words mean nothing? There's simply nothing left to do. The coast is clear. There are several orderlies who have not abandoned their duties. They're probably still out there guarding suspicious spots. They insist on staying unless you withdraw the order personally, doctor. Bootlickers, if you ask me. Subservient show-offs. Hmm. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. We're like three people away from 200, yay! Um, let them stay there. Report to me. Uh, report to me when I find them. Then I'll check the suspicious spots myself. The rest of you deserve to be court martial. You, uh, you keep that in mind, number six. Why so tense, doctor, if I may ask? Some uh, whisper snapper just rushed past me. Was it he that disturbed you? Hmm. No, it was another thing. No matter. Now off you go and start with the search. If you see anything suspicious, report to me immediately. Every hour counts now. Okay. So my journal was updated. Most orderlies have abandoned the stone yard. Few remain on duty. I have a pretty nice place. Pretty big place. Ooh, uh, let, let's... Uh, okay. I'm rummaging through my own uh, 
garbage, great. <laughs> Way to go. Well, thank you. It's, it, it takes some time. Whew. Thoughtful Odong. What the hell is this thing? Hmm. Uh, young crops will rise soon. Stone flowers. You are a herb gatherer, aren't you? You, Odong have a special way with grass and herbs, I know that. Are you expecting a ripe harvest here? Special harvest. Marble flowers, granite flowers, earth is breeding, ripe harvest on its way. What the hell? That looks so ugly. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a step creature thing. thingy. If anyone sees you, there's bound to be trouble. As far as I know, the locals aren't too fond of your kind. Okay, let me check the map. So I have to, let's see, check a patient's waiting for an examination here, flat 3. Is it the sand pest? So I'll check this one and then I'll go um, to George... Um, Georgi Kane. Georgi... Georgi? Georgi? Georgi Kane. That's a weird name. So the game, the, the game is going to be open world. Uh, the full game at least, uh, the full pathologic, so you can you can pretty much go wherever you want in the town. Uh, as I mentioned before, you ha you have three characters to control. Okay, so I'm... okay, here, this is where... Uh, this is where I have to check. Oh, there's people around. I guess that's good. Hmm. Alright, let's see. Closed. 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 Oh. Blacky! Blacky! It's not the sand pest. Don't tell don't tell them big heads. The big heads are, are the orderlies, so I'm I'm guessing I'm guessing the orderlies are looking for anyone suspicious of being of of, of infection. Um But uh, yeah. Let's see. Sorry. Uh, big heads? Um, is that your father? Stepfather. Same thing. He brought me up. Provided for me. Um, where's your mother? Hell if I know. Now come on, go ahead and make him better. Oh, Jesus, kid, I'm not... I'm not a... I'm not God. Um, here's to hoping. Okay. Let me... Let me check his stuff first. I mean, these are... These are... Raisins, he's not supposed to have raisins. Oh, wait, 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 what am I doing? Wait, I, f I totally forgot. Let me put my face mask, a basic protective item that covers your face. Okay, good. Mmm, yummy, I just ate a cracker. Yummy. Okay. I'm sorry, kid, I have to look uh, through everything you have around here. Take money. Spindle, it, it has almost run out of thread. No matter, I'll take it. I'll take it! Anything here? Hmm. This man is dead. Mm, doesn't seem like the sand pest, but there's no harm in double checking. Better safe than sorry. Um, the symptoms do not fit the horrible disease that's exterminated two thirds of the town's population in a week. Judging by the preliminary an analysis, the man died of a massive stroke. Aw, poor man. Um, I still think we should perform an autopsy. I'll call the orderlies. Let uh, I'll, uh, they'll take the body where it belongs. What the fudge? Where's the kid? Hmm? Relieved? An ordinary stroke? Yes. Not everyone dies with the sand pest. Oh no! It all begins somewhere else. You've got the wrong address. Hmm. Uh. Well, perhaps you can tell me the correct one. Oh, you thought you could catch me on the first try. This is death, by the way. This is death. That's quite an ego, doctor. Ambition seems to be your middle name. You challenge death you and expect your fight to be simple. You must be kidding. I'm almost offended. Hmm. Stop following me. Neither pox nor cholera nor sand pest kill people. All they do is reduce their lifetime. Yet the time of the world is yours to control. Who was the murderer? A microbe that let no second go to waste. Or you, 
who bothered not to hurry. I think it's the ladder. No, no, I didn't kill this man. Get lost, whoever you are. I don't want to see you again. Hmm. You are arrogant and condescending, doctor. You despise people. I, I, I don't despise them. I'm, I'm healing them. I'm helping them. Their life, health, and time means nothing to you. Want an example? You turn the cathedral into an isolation world, and now it is clock full of exhausted and terrified people. They spend a torturous night there waiting for you to examine them. Examine them. Yet you're in no hurry to relieve their suffering. Hmm. Everyone who exhibited suspicious signs was brought there. It had to be done. Orderly number 11. Uh, who are you talking to just now, Doc? Uh, 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 to you, and I've got more to say. I know who you are. I'm orderly doc. I'm an orderly doctor. Everly Gubar, number 11. These outfits, sir, make it hard to tell which one of us is which, but we're wearing them uh, on your order, sir. And they do help. Thank you kindly. Good protection. So all of this is protection against the disease, against the... Um, the sand plague. Well, it, um, you're good at changing voice, I'll give you that. Are you feeling okay, doctor, sir? You're kind of pale. Dark rings under the, uh, under the eyes present too. You must be overworked and exhausted. Your schedule is insane. You need to have a good long sleep, sir. Very long. And I'm back. Whew. Sorry everyone. My my throat's still bad. Hmm. So um Oh There's a sick person, not the plague. The man has died of a stroke. Jesus. Who the hell is this guy? Caruser. Why didn't you take the boy in? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so why didn't you take the boy in? What boy? He'll become an urchin now. Don't you realize what he'll turn into? What he'll be doing in a week's time? What boy? Exactly, what boy? You examined the late blacker, but you didn't bother with the fate of his stepson. Well, the stepson just vanished. Uh, I will be overjoyed if he's still alive enough to engage in petty thievery in a week's time. Hmm. He's probably smashing someone's windows right now. By the way, who who is going to reimburse the damage? You? What? I'm not. I'm not responsible of of some dead guy's son. Seriously. Please address your broken window concern to the headquarters at the crucible at or the judge personally. As for your stunning lack of consideration, to find the confessor. Jesus, people are so nasty. Like like I'm supposed to take care of the boy now that his his stepfather is dead? Really? Wait, let me see. Uh, I have to go here to talk to the judge. Hello. Magpie. Thank you for lifting the quarantine, doctor. It means we've managed to outlive the worst, right? No more suffering now. What? No. What do you mean lifting the quarantine? I didn't know such thing. Oh. Oh. But the soldiers have abandoned the square. I saw them leave myself. They say the shop is once again open. Those terrible orderlies is disbanded. Uh, rumor has it. An order just came through, cancelling all your previous instructions. 
This is absurd. You've been misinformed, good lady. Okay, so who who did that? I'm guessing the judge. What the hell? You look the same as the other one. What the hell? I'm seeing double? Widow. People were evicted from three houses yesterday. They must have left food behind. When is it going to be disturbed? Um... Uh, I suspect you are mistaken. Each household was provided three days worth of food for an isolation period. The bare minimum. So I have very much doubt there are any edible left anywhere. I don't know. But there, are, uh, the, but, but there may be goods inside. And those houses stand deserted anyway. So why don't they let us in? Because they can be infected, genius. Mm. And where were the evicted people relocated, I wonder? It's not like there are spare houses in the stone yard. Uh, um, when we are trying to accommodate the refugees from across the river, people were packed like sardines. Some of them even had to sleep outside. I don't know, doctor. The owners are, uh, are told to have gone back across the river. The whole deal's over, isn't it? By the way, does, that, th does this mean that our own guests will also be evicted soon? Oh, the, the refugees? Uh, no, it won't happen anytime soon. You'll have to be patient, because there's still death among us, or a plague, whatever. Plague. Let's talk to this guy, because he's like... Isn't this guy... Oh, no. Oh, he's another... Re religious buildings over... Uh, often have thick walls. Why, I wonder. So that the Holy Spirit wouldn't flutter out. No, oh, so they're fucking sturdy and tall, that's why, because the... Uh, monasteries often serve as prisons. In any case, it works in your favor. Thick walls contain moans and screams effectively. What? This is why you ordered to drag everyone suspicious to the cathedral, isn't it? So that everything could seem fine from the outside. What? No! No cheating your uh, eagle eye though. No, the people who exhibit suspicious signs are taken to the cathedral because no one in town attends that place. If I were you, I'd hurry up with the inspection. One day, so many people will be murdered up there, murdered up there that the walls won't be able to hold. No, they won't. We'll, I'll get through them. Just chillax. I'll check on that place. Just whatever. Ooh, update. Journal update. The local cathedral served as a ref for the people who exhibited suspicious signs. Get the f hell away from me, dude. I need to go to the crucible. Can I go inside this house? No. Oh, I'm guessing most houses are, are closed, right? I, I assume most of them are closed. Hmm. No one outside, that's good. Cause there is a plague, I mean. What the hell is that thing? Huh. Oh, people! Uh, so everyone, if, if the performance isn't that great and you can see some frame drops, uh, I, like, they exist. Um, it's not optimized yet, it's a pre-alpha build, so just take that into account. What the hell, is this the shop? M, what's M? M, the shop. Oh, this is the shop. Okay. Okay. Hello, lady that looks like the other two ladies that I've seen previously. Oh, I can't talk to you? I can't. I can't talk to you and I can't talk to you. Wait. Can I go inside the shop? No. Hmm. Hmm. So the crucible is over there. You know what? This, this town kind of makes me... Um, think of the some of the house design in uh, Siberia, like in in the first town that you visit in in Siberia. This grunted man, what you looking at? Move along, our business here, not 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 yours. Hmm. Wrong. As long as I'm the only doctor in this town, everything is my business. Wow. Yeah. You ordered to the uh, to lock the shop yesterday, didn't you? Well, lo and behold, it is locked. So why did you come? An exception, are ye? Locked for everyone but ye? Ye? But ye? You big city fucker. Oh, sorry. Um, uh, it hasn't been easy on, uh, on you, I know. Please stay patient some more. Just chillax. Chillax, dude. This grunt woman. 
You're playing with fire, big shot. If the shop ain't open in an hour, we'll tear it down. What? If you do, uh, it'll be your loss first and foremost. The people are starving. The children are starving. Um, what was that? Uh, what was distributed the day before yesterday? Gone now. You closed everything due to the threat of the infection. The threat is no more, so open the shop back. Or we'll, we will simply dismantle it. Our patience is running thin. Um, who told you that the threat is no more? Uh, don't know, but I know that the judge, uh, Georgie Kane himself, lives in the quarantine, unlocked the isolation ward, dismissed the orderlies of fun son of a bitch judge, so let him open the shop. If he doesn't, we'll break it open. Three huge bags of millet in there and flour too. The people know everything. Hmm. Is the empty... It's the empty can that makes the most noise. Rumor monger is worse than infection. It only promotes panic. Uh, okay. So don't don't badmouth the judge. So what happened is left in the quarantine. Okay, so this guy left left the quarantine, and that's a problem. So let's go and talk to him, cause that's uh, I don't like it. Oh, I guess that's the cathedral? Yeah, the local cathedral served as a... What the hell is that thing? Is it flying? Wow. Hello. Stranger. Doctor, did you know that uh, terrified man sneaked into Judge, judge Kane's place this night? He begged the judge to hide him. Hmm. Uh, hide? From whom? He implored the judge to hide and protect him from you, doctor. And? Has the judge agreed? Well, I don't know the details, I just thought I should tell. I'm not an informer, but now is not the time for secrets. Too much is at stake, wouldn't you agree? Actually, I do agree. Um, absolutely, you did the right thing. He did, he told me. Snitch. You are a freaking snitch, man. Snitch. Can I go inside here? Huh, no. Come on, where's the judge? Should be... okay. What the fudge is this supposed to be? Like a human? Alright. The... the... Hmm. Oh, this is a nice place, of course. Of course the judge would have the nicest place, right? Hmm, closed. Uh, okay, so it's here. This old building. Oh, what the hell? So many people here. Just like standing around. What the hell? An orderly or death? I'm, go I'm going to assume death. Oh, no. Pankrat Licobor, bachelor, can't be damned to remember my number. We got two sort of trouble here, and don't know which which is worse. Firstly, the step people abandoned them camp behind the cathedral yesterday. Hmm, the ones who stayed are preparing a funeral of some sort. Secondly, the judge uh, has kindly gone off his rocker. What? Cancels your quarantine measures, and I think he harbors an infected person too. <sighs> hmm. Where's the judge? He's home in the workshop, up the stairs and to the left. Mm, don't forget the, them step people too, just follow the footpath by the cathedral. Go to the apple tree garden, you'll see the place, or at least the smoke from their fires. Hmm. Uh, I see, where's your uh, commanding uh, orderly? As far as I know, they are planning to throw a small party at the cape, by the tombs. Oh Jesus, they're going to party? I'll shove this party right up their asses. Okay, so now I have, let's see, the step people here, the shop, the orderlies have, are having a celebration, right, great, great, celebration during these times. What the fudge? Uh, not all odds have left for the step, okay. Well, how do I get... 
Oh, there's smoke. Oh, they have weapons. Okay. This is cool. Okay, let's let's go first to the to the step people. What the fudge is that? Looks like it's a mechanical. Kind of feels a bit like Thief the Metal Age. What the what 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 are all of these uh, like? Are these leaves? Hmm. Just ahead. Okay, how do I get? Okay, step people. But how the, how the hell do I get there? Do I go through here? Oh, let's look in the dumpster. Let's look in the dumpster. Uh. Fishing hooks. Okay, I'll take the fishing hooks. Why not? Okay, so this is the way to the step people Okay, who are you bearing? Cough it up Herb bride you are the doctor we've been expecting you Um. My good people, who exactly are you planning to bury? I'd like to examine them uh, first. No, first you will listen. My husband doesn't want you to treat him. He refuses to live. We need him to live until the evening. You will help. What? Hmm. Uh, until the evening? Um, and then let him die, right? Yes. Alright, let's do it. Where is he? Go to the yurt. You are the doctor. You will help. I'm not omnipotent, uh, don't put much... Uh -huh. It's nice to have everything decided for you. Okay, so I have to keep a guy alive. For a little time at least. I don't know why. Why are they all standing here like there's nothing? Very good. We are not allowed to talk today. There's a celebration. Well, congratulations, I guess. Oh, they're burning something. Hmm. What the hell? What the hell happened to this guy? This creature is breathing heavily. A deep and dirty wound is gaping across its belly. No one's bothering to dress it. To operate on him, one would require clean bandages and painkillers, and you'll have to move fast. Uh, okay, try and operate without the items required. Bandages and painkillers. I don't have bandages or painkillers. Hmm. You know what? I'll, I'll leave. I, I can't. I can't just uh, operate right now. What? Another is in the brink of death, but he can't be operated on without painkillers and a bandage. So I have to find painkillers and the bandage. Okay. What the hell are these guys doing? Look, brethren, a snake man comes. Let us call him Moga. Moga? Moga, lovely, very evocative. <laughs> are you the guy who needs to die? Or who's soon dying? Come on, don't you have anything in here? Anything I can steal? Heal, brother. We want to celebrate. You will have gratitude. Uh, what are you celebrating anyway? The outbreak being curbed? If so, I'm afraid you're getting ahead of yourselves. Uh, probably that they're, they're doing something else. I'm glad she's warm. Oh, the cat's on me again. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. Well... What the hell is wrong with this? What are you doing? Hello? Hello, are you high? Oh, I'm a little hungry. I'm a little hungry, okay. I'll have to eat something. Soon. Uh... Okay. 
So wait. Okay, so I need bandages and stuff. All right, so I'll 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 go back, I guess, uh, until I find bandages and. Uh, as you can see, my hunger. Um, I'm I'm a little hungry now. But I can't do anything right now. Right now, I'm just going to you know. I'm just to focus on what I can do, and that is talk to the judge, and see why he called off the quarantine, and see who the hell he's hiding. What the hell? Are people singing here? I see someone there. A woman? Hmm. I'm really liking the the. It, it has this like this eerie um, feel to it. The game, Pathologic. I haven't played the original one. Actually, this is based on on on, on a game that uh, was uh, released in 2005, and which you can actually get it. Uh, it's both on Steam and on uh, Good Old Games. Interestingly enough, on Good Old Games is like on on offer 44% off, so it's less than eight dollars right now. It's like a, a remastered version. I'm really liking so in, in the full game of course you'll have to you know find more stuff, you have to um, um, survive obviously and hopefully find the cure maybe. Committee clerk. Doctor, would you mind setting an argument of ours? Uh, you are after all an outsider in this town. Hi Tomato, hi. Hi Bile. <laughs> Uh, with a clear head and a fresh outlook. We've been arguing over the reasons for the sand plague outbreak. You know, of course, uh, you would, of course, agree that it happened in this particular town for a reason, wouldn't you? Um, I don't believe in random chances. As a matter of fact, this town is nothing but a machine, produced to challenge the limits of human potential, uh, and our ideas of how people connect to each other, and our relationship, our, our relationship with nature. Uh, for more than a century, the three families ruling us have been running such experiments on the local population. You have found yourself in an utopia. Huh. Okay, so now we're getting somewhere. Now we're getting somewhere, see? Um, I found myself in hell. Get yourself together, people. Mobilize all forces. We're at your service, Bachelor. Open the shop. It's It's been quarantined long enough. There's no danger in selling groats and grain. Uh, range for beds and other necessary equipment to deliver. State vigilant. Uh, okay, let's let's give them people. Let's uh, let's give people grains and stuff so they can eat. Um, have you been uh, have you been keeping watch all night long? Let someone else take the night shift. Oh, I think it's all because of the polyhedron. I mean that gravity defying tower that children are playing in. What? Huh. Uh, to this day, I'm confused as to how it is supported. Balance somehow? I'm not that good at engineering. Uh, I'm an impressive attempt to defy the law of gravity. History already knows an example of people trying to, uh, to erect an impossible tower. It ended in tragedy. Yeah, the, uh, Babylon, right? However, your edifice looks complete. Do you believe in God, Bachelor? Well, uh, it may come as a surprise to you, but I do. There's only one thing I'm certain of. If this was an ordinarily common as Black Berry's town, there would be no outbreak. Yeah, exactly. You're you're def defying God with your crazy experiments or whatever. Uh, or it would have been something equally common and well understood like cholera or pox. Huh. Don't mix correlation and causation. Okay. Committee clerk, as for the relationship with nature, we are rebelling against it. Okay, no wonder it pushed back. The step people live as though they were in uh, in a primeval, a, a prim, primeval, 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 primeval time, uh, primeval time reserve. As uh, those stone axes are yet to be invented, worshiping bulls, talking to herbs. They don't even have uh, a real language. It's all bull, 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 bull. This girl, girl, that. Whatever. And yet, for some reason, we allow them here. But they do have a language, and a rather beautiful one. What about the sacrifices? I'll have you know that they still make those. 
it's simply wrong to entangle different ages within the same species is all. And their age is different, our time is broken, it's crippled bachelor. What? This guy's nuts. They have some, uh, they have come from the past. So release them, let them return to the earth they hold, they hold so dear. Let them go. Is someone holding them here? Actually, yeah. Someone is. Our rulers. They have embedded the steppe people into this town, carved them into its warm flesh. This isn't a town, it's an honest to god minotaur. Oh, that's nice. A chimera. And chimeras have remarkably short lifespans and bad health. Can you inbreed a snake and a crane? Uh, you can, yes. Yeah? But the progeny won't live long. Hmm. Have you ever seen a mule? Right, exactly, yeah, that's, that's a good... This is an impossible town, bachelor. You just can't have your cake and eat it. Can't mix oil and water. Can't connect similarly charged magnet poles. Or rather, you can, but only by force. And as soon as that force falters, it's all going to be shredded to pieces. We are abusing nature. Oh, this guy is... If not for the rebellion against nature, we wouldn't be able to use fire. Hello, committee clerk. As for me, doctor, I'd say it's simple. Men must be been remodeled or altered, even if they ask for it themselves. What? Felt sorry for, yes, but not altered. What's wrong with men anyway? Uh, what do you mean exactly? We have so little time on this earth that it's barely possible to scratch the surface of what we are, let alone explore human humanity fully. Man is infinite. Wow, that he, this guy's deep. Um, but what does it have to do with the epidemic, exactly? I don't know. I don't feel like, uh, I don't feel that this is the root of the problem. It wasn't we who designed the world like this. I believe in men, doctor. In superhumans, I don't. Okay, that's good. This earthly life wouldn't fit them. Immortals have no place in the world of the living. This is just how it works. Take from it what you will. No, I I'm going to take that, that you don't understand what the hell is going on. A lot of people have died in this town. We're in a small, 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 small section that has that doesn't have any infection just yet, and you're freaking rambling about superhumans and gods and living and pe people people being uh, infinite. Focus on the freaking task at hand, okay? Jesus, um, that's some fervor, exactly. Just shut the hell up, dude. Shut the hell up. Ah, <sighs> what the hell is the... Where's the judge? What the hell is this guy? What the fudge? Doorkeeper, what the? Slenderman! Uh, the judge has lost his mind, bachelor. He denies the obvious, claims that the epidemic is still here. Well, it is, you son of a... Um... What? If what we're saying is true, why the bloody hell is the judge doing what he's doing? Why is he cancelling my orders? I know very little. The judge... The, the judge... Uh, the judge is a brilliant... The judge is? What? The judge is a brilliant mind. Master used to be extremely shrewd and... Uh, consci conscious? Whatever. Uh, help him, doctor. Perhaps pills or leeches are in order. A bloodletting, maybe? What? No, I'm not, I'm a doctor. I'm not, I'm not with that voodoo. Um, just let me in. Okay. So I don't know who the hell this guy is, but he's freaking weird. J. Let's see J. Uh, what? The judge is seemingly the only person around who doesn't believe that the outbreak has been curbed. Well, that's good. Then why the hell did he call off the? Uh. Okay. Then why the hell call off the the quarantine? That's weird. Can I go here now? Can I steal anything from here? Come on. Uh, I can't steal shit. Seriously, I need food and stuff. Okay, judge. Georgi Kane, the judge. I drop by your place at dawn, bachelor. Wow, he has some really good hair. Everyone, let's just admire his hair. I mean, this is... Uh, this is really good. Hmm. 
really good hair. Anyway, um, wanted to warn you of my plans. Your young assistant asked me not to disturb you. Uh, I judge that it is better to let you have some rest. Uh, the catastrophe has already struck, and you need all the strength you could muster to face the trials of the day. Um, um, there's a carrier here. Where are they? Indeed. A frightened, odd-looking man begged me for shelter yesterday. I let him go. What? Why? Are you shitting me? I can't believe my ears. You let him go? Why in the world? Quite so. For I am the judge. And as, com as is commonly agreed upon, I boast a certain level of intelligence. Really? It's plain to me that you are on the verge of shredding me into pieces. But still your wrath. Uh, as a great Athenian once said, strike if you will, but here... Dude, where is he? I'm listening. You are a fanatic uh, bachelor, a crusader. Your whole life is a duel with death. I know, I've read your articles. Follow your progress in the capital. For many years you've been trying to eliminate the very phenomenon of death. Well, not exactly, but anyway. You continue this war of yours and this town too, but I implore you to look at this problem from a different angle. What do, what do you mean? Uh, different angles such as a plague is just a type of death to you but to me it's essentially an exam and one must not run away from exams forever sooner or later one must take them uh, I don't understand wait an exam explain yourself is uh, this is a rather unexpected interpretation of a catastrophe that took away half the population of your town I have built this town bachelor it's very unusual you have to admit this imponderable tower is, uh, is its uh, crowning achievement, and it was I who envisioned it like this. Surely you do not, not you do not allow the thought uh, that I do not care for it. Well, I, I'm not saying you're not caring. I say you're pretty much mad. This is my life's work. There's nothing in the world more dear to me. Hmm. Uh. And yet you lifted the quarantine, exposing your creation. Would you put your own children on train tracks too? Just to check because I'm not entirely impossible. It's uh, it's not entirely impossible. It wouldn't survive. Uh, towns are like people. Some are common and plain, content with their plainness. Others try to prevail over their nature, grow, reach for the sky. Mm, so you think the epidemic is a punishment for the attempt? This is all testament logic. Don't jump to conclusions. This isn't a punishment, this is an exam. Can't you tell the difference? An exam can be passed, and then one can move forward. Uh, okay, so what does that mean? Jesus, so freaking cryptic. I mean, I, I know, cryptic, I bit cryptic, but yeah. Um, perhaps a town can pass it, yes. But what about single individuals? The mere mortals? Uh, are those who do not strive for good, uh, for good who word unworthy of living? My heart aches for them. This is dreadfully cruel. But perhaps the thing we are trying to build can only be erected with the help of those who have passed it. The exam of death. Wait, wait, so you want to have people dying so you can evolve the town? Who has learned not to fight it like you do? Not to deny it, but rather uh, understand it? No, embed it into themselves. Use it. Humanity has learned to use the law of gravity, hasn't it? There is your proof. Just look out the window. There was a time when humans could not brave the sky, but that time has passed. So what does that mean? That we have to brave, we have to master, embed death somehow? You <coughs> Sorry. You make a reasonable point. It just gave me an idea. Never mind though. Okay. Wait, 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 so... Uh, have forgotten something very dear to you. What? What did I forget? Hmm. The shop. I've been at the step people. The orderlies. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, the judge claims that death is not the end, but rather an exam waiting to be passed by every person. Alright. So... Alright. So I guess now we 
continue our journey. Maybe I should find something to help heal the guy, uh, the the step guy. I'm not going to the church yet, and I know why. Mm, let's go to the shop. Let's go to the shop because now it should be open, and people should be thanking me. They should be uh, praising me. I hope. Is it open? Oh, it's open, right? Nice, it's open. So, it's interesting that the judge knows that there's someone with uh, the plague, but... Oh, I can buy stuff from them. Okay, cool. Uh, bandages. So, I need bandages, so let me buy. Hmm. Uh, 150. Okay, I can buy them. Trade. Nice! Wait, 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 all of them? No, 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 I didn't want to give all my money away? What? Oh, come on. I gave all my money? Jesus. Okay. Okay, I don't need a pocket watch. Give me back my money. Hmm. Okay. Let's trade two beetles. Hmm. Morphine. Hooks? Do you want hooks? Mm, what is matches? Do you want matches? This? No. Water? No. Milk? I need the money back. Okay. Okay, so I got my money back. Uh. And I traded my watch, but but now I have bandages, which I'm, I can I can use, and I needed something else, right? Female cat knight is old and healthy as sin. Really? Wow! Wow! That's. Uh, let's see the inventory. Wait, wait. No journal. Um. Painkillers and and okay, I need painkillers then. Immune boosters, I don't have painkillers, unfortunately. It's okay. Let's, um... Uh, let's go back a little, I guess. <laughs> she got old. <laughs> How did she survive she got old? What the hell? Hello. Hello, soldier. Look, they have guns, I mean... Finally, you're here, Doctor. I just uh, shoot a bunch of children away. They tried to sneak in. I seized lockpicks from them, too. Didn't uh, find the heart to shoot them, sir. Forgive me. They're just children, after all. Why would you shoot children, you dumbass? How's it going? It's going okay. Um, uh, I've never... Lockpicks? Yes, sir. Kids often felt uh, about uh, empty flats, and the owners of this house were evicted. Here, sir, the two lockpicks uh, I confiscated, uh, but they still got more. Uh, they'll never back off. I know what I'm talking about, sir. I just, uh, um, I was just like that myself. Okay, so okay, so children won't like to go where they're not supposed to go. That's fine. Did you lose all the money? No, I didn't lose all my money. I just spent it all. Uh, the, the, I spent it all, but I got it back. I got it back, and I got, I got, um, I got bandages. I got clean bandages, which I need them. I need clean bandages and I need painkillers to operate on the step guy. So, uh, okay, hand them over. Oh, nice. Uh, wait. Lockpick. Twisted and uneven. The local lockpicks require a fast jabbing motion to unlock a door, else they'll become uncoiled. Nice. I have a lockpick. Nice. And I can raid this house and get stuff. <laughs> okay, I'm going to get as many things as possible, but because I can. Nothing here? Oh, oh, hello, money! Hello, money. Water bottle, yes. Cracker, yes. Hmm. Huh. Okay, so. Okay, that's cool. The noon has come. Okay, so what does that mean? Chapter began in everybody's lives. Okay, what does that mean? Pop shot, hi pop shot. 
What the hell does that mean? Uh, okay. Dusk bridge. Okay, wait, I'm, I'm trying to do stuff. What the hell? Dead body here. Uh, antibiotic. Okay, I'm going to take this. I'm going to take this from, from you, citizen. Okay, let me put this here, this here, put this here, here, here. We're good? We're good? Jesus, people died in here. Oh, more money. Broken scissors. I don't know, I'll take them. Maybe I can use them, I, I can do use them to trade. It's pretty cool that I found the lockpicks. Okay, I'll take the beetles. What the fudge? Everyone's dead in here! Are you kidding me right now? Everybody's freaking dead. This is crazy. This is freaking crazy. Ooh, what's this? Protective footwear rising above your troubles and the plague salt ground. Nice. Okay, can I can I equip them? Uh, my feet. Oh yes, nice. Cool. I'm so well equipped now. I mean, I didn't want to steal from the dead, but, you know, it happens. I mean, more money, yes. They were preparing to leave. Hmm. Oh, oh wait, what was in here? More money, a beetle. It's so nice that you can just, like, go into buildings now with the lockpicks. Oops. Sorry. Okay. Okay. And uh, and this. What? Where's my lockpick? Oh, I don't have a lockpick anymore. Ah. What? That's unfortunate. Oh come on. What the hell? She's tied up in here. What the hell did these people do here? Oh, I just need more lockpicks, apparently. Mm. Oh, so much money. Ah, lockpick! Oh, maybe she was like a... Um... Um... Like um, a thief or something, and then they... And they got her. Hmm. Food? Oh no, more money, wow. So much money. Okay, no more lockpicks, unfortunately, I guess. I don't know how they, they get destroyed like that, but anyway. Okay, okay, so we found... Uh, found quite a few things here. Let's go to the order list, because they're, they're having a party right now, and I don't like them having a party. I wonder where else I could go. Hmm, okay, let's just go back. Let's go back. I wish I could just enter every house and steal everything. Okay. Where the hell am I right now? Wait, wait, wait. Where am I? Oh, I'm here, okay. Okay, I have to go back there, okay. Jesus, it's 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 easy to get lost in this town. Hmm, children. Hello children, what are you doing here? Sleepyhead. Shrew's got the keys, not me. I don't need to go in there anyway. One can catch him uh, from over the, here just fine. Uh, what's in there? Two solid... <coughs> Sorry. Two solid masters are drying in there right now. Uh, Sixkin... S Siskin and Lotman. Both have been over the river and now they're done for. That's what you get for getting carried away. Anyway, I want to collect uh, them into nuts. What? Collect them into nuts. Hmm. Okay, what does that mean? Uh, 
Huh, I'll listen to, to them before I go to sleep and they'll advise me. Collect them into nuts? How? A nut is a tricky fruit. It resonates. If you do everything properly, you can preserve a person inside, got it? Talk to him after death and all. Uh, through a teeny, uh, teeny tiny hole. If he agrees to, I mean. Uh, what if he doesn't? Well, then you wait for him to get bored. It's probably super tiresome sitting inside and not talking to no one. Eternal life must be tedious. Uh, clearly you have a lot of experience in such matters. Okay, J. What did I... You can hear footsteps from behind the locked door of one of the houses in the dust district. Which one is that? This one? Maybe I can go inside here? Hmm, no? Hello? Oh, this is trashed. Like, trashed, emptied. Hmm. Oh, more money, good. And the spindle, which I can't use, but never mind. What the hell happened here? What do we have? Oh, a beetle, great. Another beetle! And more money. Oh, I have so much money. Where the hell is everyone? Uh, use bandage. Okay. Peanuts! Ooh, peanuts! Cool! I found peanuts! Yay! I can eat some peanuts. Ah, uh, okay. Where the hell are the... Okay, so I can't get in. I don't know where the the coughs are coming from. Hmm, maybe the the kids know. Maybe the children know. Oh, maybe it's in this house. Oh, come on, everything is closed. I'm a doctor. Come on. I'm a doctor, I can help! Or I can kill you and take your stuff. Hmm. I still need I still need an uh, antibiotics from somewhere. They're here somewhere, either here or here. Oh more stuff to loot obviously. Oh nothing. Come on. Nothing. Beds Oh, leather gloves, nice. Okay, take the leather gloves, wait. Okay, let me, let me use the leather gloves then. Uh, protective ha uh, handwear, the local leatherworks are a less known branch of Fat Vlad's Bull Project. Okay. I also get a knife, a weapon, I can get an... Um, hmm, cool. Okay, let's go down. Let's talk to the children. Maybe they know something. Where exactly the 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 people who are dying here are. What the hell are they, they doing there? Okay. Um. Did I find a use for the spindle? No, no, I don't think you can actually use it. Uh, I think you can sell it. It doesn't look like you can actually use it. Not sure. How's Blackie? Oh, Sticky. He's Sticky. He's fine, but his step step uh, father died. I have a very important thing to ask you. Don't listen to Shuro, okay? And never ever give her nuts. It's all a trap. Got it? Um. Right, what are you doing? What are you lot doing here? Sleepyhead over there is waiting for the departed to depart. Soon they will. It's a game of ours. You kids play peculiar games. Yeah, they're waiting for people to die. Shrew wants you to die. Don't give her anything. Shrew? You mean the pigtails girl? Have I wronged her somehow? 
Hmm. Uh, not at all. She just thinks uh, your whole ordeal is wrong and, f and feels sorry for you. So a child wants me dead for some reason. Great. Thing is, I don't want you to die. You know what? If you find any nuts, bring them to me instead. I'll give you anything in exchange. How about bandages? You're a doctor. You probably need those. No, actually, I need. I have bandages, kid. I need. Uh, I need some antibiotics. Uh, bandages? Uh, why do you even have them? In any case, wouldn't it be responsible for you to give them to me without the nut fee? Look, just don't give any nuts to Shrew, right? Give them to me instead. I don't want you to die. I can keep. Uh, you can keep living with us. Teach me too. I want to be a doctor, you know. <laughs> we'll take this, kill them all, take their stuff in the game. Yeah, it's all. You can't really go everywhere. That's um. Hmm. Here, uh, will this kind of not do? Okay, so I can, I can. Let's see. What do we have here? So he has milk, antibiotic. Wait, didn't I find an antibiotic? Oh, I have it. Okay. Canned food? Where the hell did this guy have also so many stuff? Powder? The box is to be filled with powder made of assorted ground ground pills. Alright. Well, give me some bandages, kid. No, you don't want to. Oh, he doesn't want any money, he just wants nuts. Okay. Alright, kid. Close, I'm not going to trade with you. Uh, I traded nuts to... Sticky. Okay, so I have... Wait, wait, wait. I, I just needed... Alright. Painkillers and a bandage, but I don't have a painkiller. Seriously. Hmm. Painkillers and a bandage. I don't have freaking painkillers. What's M? Here, an outhouse picture. Something feels off. Well, well, people are dying inside. Where the hell is the... The other one. There were like three children here. Hmm. Okay, she's over there. Right? So here's how it's going to be with you, huh? Well, in that case, you're no friend of mine. What? Shrew. What did I do to lose your favor? So when Sticky asks you for nuts, you're all happy to run his errands. You're all happy. You're all too happy uh, to run his errands and oblige, huh? And I'm second class. Do you even know why he doesn't want me to help you? Hmm. I have so many painkillers. Well, I, I I need just one, I guess. I just need one. Hmm. Uh, no, I don't know why. Because he doesn't want to let you pass away like normal people do. Cause uh, you two are BFFs now or something. Really? These guys know BFFs? Hmm. Uh, he wants to learn stuff from you, and he, uh, and so he clings to you, sticks to you, cures you, and generally plays doctor. Moron! You need to have a pillow stuffed over your face and your soul stuck into a nut for safekeeping. Jesus, this girl is insane! What the fudge? She wants to kill me and put me in a freaking nut. She is crazy. Um, you clearly have a kind, a, a very kind and compassionate heart. I'll try to make do without the pillow, though, right? This is pointless. Look, everyone hears, uh, hears what a person whose mind was raised by sickness looked like. You are delirious, do doctor. Uh, raving. Do you understand? You're sick. Got infected with the sand plague, and so you're hallucinating. It's, uh, it's midnight now, and you're at your place looking after you. And we're at your place looking after you. What? Uh, well, uh, I'd say um, it's you who seems to be... Uh, okay, I don't feel sick at all. Wait, what happened? What just happened? According to Shrew, I'm delirious right now, hallucinating yesterday's events. And this isn't the first time it happens. The, the, the kind girl wants my misery to end. Okay. Yeah, she just wants me dead. Okay, let me just go... I want to go all the way up there to where the olderies are celebrating. Seriously. I, and I need someone to give me uh, some painkillers. Ooh, marbles. You look marbles. Hmm. Why is everyone here? Believer, I came here before you 
But you may go f uh, go in first. I need to pluck up my courage. What's inside? Tonight, Aspidi came here. Shakbao Duden, our mother and the mistress of dreams. And you're expecting this family reunion to go less than smoothly, I gather? Huh. Indeed, I dream of a frightening thing today. Only Aspidi can tell the dream truths from dream lies. Hmm. What a curious coincidence. I also happen to dream of a rather frightening uh, thing today. Thanks for letting me cut the queue. I will uh, indeed have a chat with this individual. Okay, M. So this is an odd woman, possibly quack, who is told to have found the cure for the plague lives here. What? What the hell just happened? J. The suspicious visitors of a house in the dust district claim that they've come to see a dream teller. Oh, okay. Uh. Okay. It's raining. What do we have in here? Package. The step people bury the remains of their dead in small packages. Ew, it's a dead body. It's a dead body. Jesus. Oh, I hear someone coughing. Oh, what? Her? What is she doing here? What the hell? Ask me, hello doctor. What did you dream of today? I dreamed... I dreamed that an outbreak would happen here today. The plague itself came to me uh, wearing an orderless outfit and gave me time until the evening. Nomad, it sounds stupid when I say it out loud. I need a dream hook. Try to remember the mood, if only for a second. And the game is talking dreams too? Yeah, exactly, yeah. Um, see, everything is intertwined. Intertwined, and then... Even a single detail that seems pivotal to you. Just don't try to invent anything new. Remember it. Then, it'll be... Uh, I'll be able to see your dream as if it was mine. Hmm. Uh, the sang plug into the stone yard. I confronted death like I always do. It asked me if I was ready to die. You're missing the point, doctor. And I think you also tend to mix up death and plague. Um, which are actually not the same. Well, yeah. You mix up death, death and death. But, you are, but they are not the same. You can't even tell death from death. Not the same. How many different words did I use? 40 something, all the meanings. One, are you telling me they sounded different to you? The thing that came to you tonight was death, not death as you thought. It wants you to understand why it haunts you, and it won't take you until you do. It's as simple as that. I see, so I was supposed to just accept everything and meekly go belly up? No, if you agree to die without understanding, you will simply cease to exist. This is getting weirder and weirder. I doubt that the world, uh, that, that, uh, that uh, I, I doubt that that would be the interest of you, and it definitely be it would definitely be pointless to your visitor, and they would never do anything unless it has a point. Yeah, because death always has a point. Great, yeah, exactly. Right, right, right. Death always has a point. Right. Oh. Okay. Um, death literally is the cessation of existence. It, I've been studying it all my life. I know what I'm talking about. Hmm. This is precisely why it just can't take you in. You're blind. You don't know the first thing about it. Death is not the end. Not at all. Would you like me to prove it to you? You're a doctor. You'd easily see through any act. Watch me die properly. When it knocks, simply open the door. Um. All right, let's take a look at your proof. What the hell? Oh, what the fudge? Oh, are you kidding me right now? Oh, she's dead. What? You never wanted to come to this wretched town. What the hell? How the hell did you do that? This is only the beginning? Well... See? There's nothing terrible about it. I died properly. 
Uh, hmm, care, care to do an encore? Slowly, please. This is a rather um, tortuous experience, Bachelor. Very much so, to be honest. So why did you do it then? This time I did because I needed to convince you that running away from death will get you nowhere. You won't win this way. You'll only make it worse. There's no need to hurry though. Suicide only leads to void. It's not the right way to cross the threshold. How can it be worse? And if death is so pain painful, why hurry? Because there is fear swelling inside you. And fear won't help you understand how to die properly. Even without the understanding, you will still die, Bachelor. But it won't be the... <coughs> Sorry. But it won't be the true death. To the contrary, it will be your complete, absolute end. Jesus. You will simply cease to be. It's not quite as unpleasant as eternal damnation, but still rather less than thrilling. Hmm. Uh, huh. Alright, I need to mull this whole situation over. Oh, what? She just disappeared? Hmm. The hell? Are the people still here? No, they're, they disappeared. Oh, another house? What the hell is this thing? Huh. Let's go up, I guess. <laughs> PayPal or Patreon? Oh, this is like, like a building here. Oops, oops, sorry. Oops, come on. Jesus. Was this guy guarding another... Maybe I can get in another house and steal more things. Okay, let's see. So I guess that's across the river. Uh, okay, there's nothing here. Hmm. All right, let's just uh, let's go to the orderlies. We have a bone to pick with them. What the hell happened here? Was this like a house? Was this a house and that just got destroyed? But how would the only the the staircase survive? That is odd. Am I going the right way? Yeah, kind of. Inspecting the side, doctor. There's no one here. One civilian got in, and in uh, and in he stayed. He shouted and shouted and shouted, and then he didn't. Um, where's everyone? No one's reporting that to us. Some people say they've been sent back across the river. Others uh, that they were just relocated to another to other houses. Hmm. <coughs> hmm. Okay, that's interesting. <clears throat> Mm. Why were they evicted in the first place? Must be something scary inside. Perhaps the tenants found it. Don't know. Hence me asking, are you here to inspect the place? Hmm. Indeed, I'm afraid I found the thing I was looking for. Okay, let's inspect the place. What the hell? Another one of these guys? No. P, what the P means? Oh, come on. You need to look it in the eye, face to face. What? To dance with death, you need to face it. Death is a beast of prey, never turn your back on it. Uh, we're locked in and I don't think uh, they'll let us out. What shall we do? Listen, if you can hear it, that means it's close. That means you must, mon uh, you must muster up your courage and look it in the eye. Then it will freeze for a while, and you'll get the chance to move forward. Okay. Does this have, house have a second exit? You need to find it yourself. And then I'll uh, leave you be. Uh, don't test my patience. I'm asking you again. Is there a way out of here? You don't understand. I was speaking literally. No metaphors. Face death. Don't your, turn your back to it. Find yourself. Waste no time. All right, I'll take a look around. H-E-T. 
So apparently there's death somewhere. I don't know where. Okay. Let's go up. Uh This death? A key. It's cold. Crap. Let's get out of here. I, I got the key, I got the key. I hope this is the key for the house. Oh crap, no. Oh come on. Where is this key from then? Uh What? Oh, I got my watch. Oh! Whoo! What the hell? We're good, we're good. What the hell was that? Oh, I'm back here again? My health went down. I don't know why. Huh. Okay. Oh, I'm... Uh, this is a different house. It's not mine. No, this is a different house, but it looks like mine. Huh. What the hell just happened? Oh, some coins. I like coins. More coins. Another bug. What the hell just happened? So I really must be careful when going in houses. Okay, another hook. Maybe I should get the... Uh, wait, can I can I drink this? Did my health go up? No. Oh, my health... Okay. Alright, so... That's odd. Okay, let's go... Um, what the hell? Oh. What the hell are the orderlies? They should be here somewhere. What oh, freaking weird park. Hmm. Freaking weird park, Jesus. I'm kinda liking this game. It's um definitely atmospheric. What a cow? What the hell is everyone? Oh look, they're there. Uh, what the hell is this thing though? Huh. Okay, what the hell are you doing guys with partying? Seriously? You're supposed to be working? Hmm. The local cathedral. Here an odd house pick children's curiosity. Something feels off. Yeah, but I can't go inside. Orderly in chief. I can't believe my eyes. Same here. What are you doing here? Why have you all abandoned your duties? According to our papers. One moment please. I'll find the precise... Ah, oh, here it is. After a short burst of fever, having woken up from anxious dreams, Bachelor... Uh, Daniel Dankowski passed away in his own bed yesterday after 9 o'clock as the uh, only known victim of the sand plague. Signed by me, right? Because if it isn't, that means you're out of line executing random orders. 
since no signs of sand of the sand plague were located in the stone yard, the orderly committee um, have an un uh, 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 unanimously decided to disband the medical worker corpse. Um, the most committed orderlies went across the river to transport dead bodies. Ah, oh, great. Uh, the least co uh, committed ones went home. As for us, we've stayed here to celebrate your victory. Um, victory? Nothing's over yet. I don't know, according to the judge's orders, there's nothing more to be done here. And in that case, in the case of Bachelor Dankowski's death, the judge is the only person whose orders I'm supposed to follow. Here, see? I got it all in writing, legal stuff. Hmm. How about getting your peepers open, you cretin? Here, I'm alive, right in front of you. I don't know what you're talking about. I got it all in writing, anyone can impersonate Bachelor Dankowski. What? I'm here, dude, I'm alive! As for me, I'm, I'm just standing my watch as I'm an, uh, as an official representative. Hmm. Fine, you can visit me. Well, since I'm dead, it's within the scope of your responsibilities to attend my place personally to oversee the funeral. Someone will have to take care of the bodies when the worst happens. Whatever that means, I don't know. I added something, but I don't know what. Uh, or this disappeared. Okay, J. The orders have me registered among the deceased. Someone will have to pay for this sick joke. The plague is but um, who is my true foe? Okay. So So now I should go back maybe? Yeah, let's go back. I, I wish I had like a um, fast travel thing. Like the option to fast travel. Because now I need to go all the way to the other side of town. All the way there and maybe uh, go to the cathedral maybe? Hmm. The shop. I still can't operate on the guy because I don't have antibiotics and I don't know where to get them. Uh, this is my house, right? I think. Yeah, that, that this was my house. What if I go back? Uh, well, the guy is still here. Okay. Huh. Okay, this is eerie. Really, really eerie. Okay, let's go back, I guess. Hmm. Anyone? Anyone? Children playing? Oh, rats. Where the rat? Where's the rat going? Maybe I can follow it. A boot. Okay. Maybe if I follow the rat, it will lead me somewhere. Or maybe just running like like crazy. It doesn't matter. Maybe the rats don't don't mean anything. Is this the house? No. Huh. That is odd. Rats. Just had to be rats. Okay, let's go then to... Uh... I don't know. Back to the shop, maybe? Or the cathedral this time? Uh, so I'm here. The set people are preparing for the funeral. Huh. The warrants, full list, ball, and what? Med stock. But I don't have the... 
Okay, but what are the antibiotics? Seriously, do I need to go back home and get meds? I don't know. I don't. I don't. F I didn't find anything. From what I remember, at least. Okay, let's go back. Let's go back and maybe we can find something. It's really loud. The rain is really freaking loud. Hmm, okay. Because it said... One, the warrants, two for list, three, one, four med stock. What's four? Like the room four? Because if I find if I find something, maybe I can uh, operate on the guy. Why is this here? This wasn't here before. Fire maker. I'm doing my best to hurry, doctor, sir. I really am. Dismantling these bloody things takes time, but we're doing it. Um. Stop. Leave it. Uh. Well, it's not like anyone needs them anymore, sir. And it's getting colder by the day. October is at hand. Christian should start uh, Patreon. I'm happy to do it. <laughs> well, thank you. Well, I, I'm just, you know, I'm just, um, I, I'm, I'm not going to make anything just yet. Um, I mean, it, it would be great if I could, you know, if you know people who watch me and, and, and like what I do and can contribute can could, but um, uh, but right now I'm, I'm I'm not going to make a Patreon. Um, I, it, it, you know what? It needs to be done properly. Like I need to offer. You know, uh, uh, you know, good incentives for people to 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 pledge. Uh, means okay. Don't worry, uh, don't you worry. I'll, you'll get warm in the evening when all the dead bodies will pile up and require moving around. Uh, if you want to live, you have to listen to me, and I'm telling you that you're loosening safety measures prematurely. If no outbreak happens by the evening, you'll light. It in celebration, okay. Yeah, I don't like all of these uh, rats. I mean, uh, okay, okay. Le let's look for the. Uh, let's look for the meds. I really hope I can find some medication. Cause I really need it. Oh, this guy wasn't here before. Really, this guy wasn't here before from what I know. Oh, come on, here maybe? Uh, Tunic? Rubber? Okay, I'll just get the money. This is my money anyway. Um, well, I don't know if it, 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 ha it doesn't have to be made, but it is, you know, it, it would be, you know, one, uh, one way of, uh, of, of supporting, you know, m uh, you know, my channel and what I do. Um, but I don't know right now. Only number 12 arrived here at uh, at your best behest, Doc. Uh, I was here by the fire. I see that you clearly are alive. Who cares uh, what the legal papers say? It's not like I can read anyway. Um, why not? Uh, why no cloak, though? Uh, aren't you afraid of infection? I am, Doc, but I need my hands free. Uh, you're out of line, number 12. If you leave this house, you'll have to put it on. Too late now, anyway. Okay. Okay, I really need to find freaking meds. Where the hell are the meds? Meds, meds, meds. Where are the meds? I'll push 50 euros a month. Wow, that's a lot. Wow, that's a lot, Christopher, really. Like, even saying that, really, thank you. Uh, uh, I, I really need to find freaking meds. If anyone has any meds... Four. What's four? What was four? Okay, no one's here. At least I'm not dead yet, so that's good, I guess. Come on. No meds. Jesus. Jesus, seriously. Okay, so there's nothing here. I can't go here for some reason. The light is busted. Oh, come on. Jesus. Fix the freaking light. Can I talk to this guy, maybe? The air is changing. Hear it. The smell is changing. Touch it. Something bad is brewing right here. 
Um, do you feel something odd? What is it? Look closely. Listen closely. Where are the flies flying? Where are the rats rattling? There is new life germinating. Soon it begins. Then take your stone grass, stone grass with you and get lost. Oh. Oh, let me one second. Let me just uh, lower the volume because that this is way too loud right now. Sorry, pathologic. You're just going to like. I just need to lower your freaking volume by fifty percent, just because I I can't hear it. Hmm. All right. So I I have no idea where to go now. I can't really go for the rats. I should go. Uh, I really want to investigate here, but it doesn't let me go in uh, where I want to go. Like, um... I can jump, I guess. Wait, why are the people there? They were, uh, they were gone before. Oh, it stopped raining, finally. Freaking rain. Freaking rain. Freaking rain. Okay, let's eat. Okay, that didn't give me a lot of hunger. Okay, why are the people here? Oh no, they're not here, they're just like wandering. Okay. I need... I need... Jesus. What the hell? Who are you? Death? Or the number two? Number two reporting in. You know, no matter what they say, I couldn't believe you were done for. And right I was! I'm not dead! Yay! What have you been done for? Uh, report the situation. Reporting in. The Dust District House 1. Um... Um, there it is to the left with the smoking chimneys harboring as aspity a local quack a local quack there's a rumor sucking that she's not success, uh, susceptible to the sand pest and can cure it too I talked to her she's crazy um, house to the right a suspicious group of children ogling its windows they're probably up for not good hmm. how is dust marked again a semicircle on a horizontal line, bachelor, means the sun is setting. Okay. J. Well, I, I've done a lot. One can hear footsteps from behind the locked doors of one of the houses in the dust district. Okay. But... But I can't go there, so... I've gambled my soul away. Really? Um... Now that's a stake. They left the stupid theater behind across the river now uh, are uh, uh, and are now idling away in a square in front of the blood, bloody, bloody cathedral. I wonder how they got here in the first place. But they won't accept your bet to each their own, as the saying goes. True. To each their own. I don't know what that means. The local actors are staging a mind play in front of the cathedral. Hmm. Maybe I should uh, visit them. Maybe I should check that out, because I still can't get in here. Dusk bridge. I mean... I still can't get into this house, apparently. Can I get a lockpick, maybe? Um, Do you have any bandages left? No. Come on... Uh... Hmm... Antibiotic. Well, that's pretty cheap. Can I get a lot of stuff from you? Oh, he wants only... This guy only wants... I forgot. He wants only nuts. Great. What do you think about the game? I like it. I definitely like it. It's it's weird. It's weird. It's like... It's eerie. Um, it, it, it has that... It There's that... There's a pressure that you feel like there's always something looming. It's not something like behind you or anything like that. It's, it's like just somewhere, something always there. Um, it, it's it's an interesting feeling. I I I kind of like it. I kind of like it, and I like the oh, where's the store? Okay, the shop. Um, I like the idea. Uh, the, the 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 graphics I think can could be improved. The performance, of course, will improve more, but um, but I'm really liking it. What can I say? Oh, I can get bread. Morphine. Uh, do I need morphine? A person is only alive as long as they feel. Uh, raisin walnuts. Chestnuts. I got um, 
Arby's now? What was that? Should I get some bread? I'm not that hungry though. Uh, maybe I'll, I, I should get some bread though, right? I think. Some bread. What? She won't trade? I have 292, are you shitting me? Wow, that was barely enough? Wow, okay. Are you kidding me? Four raisins and you don't want to? Okay. Here's a freaking broken scissors. I mean... Hmm... Characters are little... Oh! Oh, Christopher, the, the, the characters, I'm pretty sure that that will be changed so the characters don't look the same. This is just a pre-alpha with some elements of the game in them. Oops, sorry. Fishing hooks, come on. We can trade, right? Ah, we can trade, nice. Can't believe I traded all my money for food. Anyway. Anyway, let's see what the actors are doing. Where are the actors? Oh, they're there. Look. What the hell is this guy doing here? Factory worker. Hmm. Um, hmm. I'm starving, barely standing still. I'm sorry, but I don't have anything to share with you. If I if I give you the bare necessities I have, I'll simply kick the bucket myself. Oh, he wants food? I don't have food, dude. Screw you. Okay, let's go to the... What the hell are they doing? These are the actors? Uh, what the hell are you doing? Here comes Bachelor Darkowski, the man who failed to defeat death. How do you know? We know all about you. We know what you did yesterday and what you're going to do tomorrow. What? Really? And what did I do yesterday? Yesterday, stuffed our houses clock full of refugees from across the river, forbidding them to go outside. Robbed our wardrobe department and dressed your medical staff as mourners. Judge the judge. Uh, you don't seem to hold my achievements in high regard. Everything will be decided this evening, Excellency. A terrible appointment is in store for you, and you will not emerge from it victorious. Um, uh, it, it, it will uh, be of no use to the bachelor. Why is that? Only a man with an open heart can overcome such an uh, adversary. So if I had a softer heart, you'd teach me how to win this duel. Maybe, possibly, but it's useless to explain to a heartless man. Oh, maybe I need to, f I, I, I need to feed that guy. Yeah. Even though it all sounds like a rather impossible turn of events. Um. Okay. Not the plague. The man has died of a stroke. The tragedy, but that I have no heart. Okay. You know what? Let's try to operate on the guy. Let's try to operate on the guy. Let's try to operate on the... I mean, what's the worst that could happen? Right? Let me eat. Uh, let's not eat the walnuts. Let's eat some raisins. Okay. And let's go operate on the little guy. The, the weird guy. I mean... Are you kidding me? I got a roast beef, curlies, and a Pepsi. Ooh, I have Pepsi too. I just don't have anything else. Actually, I have not. I I haven't eaten anything today. That's. I should look into that. I should definitely look into that. Maybe some pizza. I think I deserve a pizza after today. Seriously, after today, I just like I, I need I, I need a freaking vacation. Not that I'm going to take any. No, no, no vacation. Definitely no vacation. Just um. Okay, let me let me help the guy. Let me help the guy die. Jesus, so many, so many people dead here. Come on, don't you have any... Ah, uh, crap, okay. You have everything you need, proceed to the operation, what? What, how? What do I... Bandages, I have the bandages, but I don't have... Oh, I have morphine, maybe that? Love Coke more than Pepsi, yeah, Coke is better, true, Ag agreed. Okay, let's operate. Not you. Who did this to you? This one looks suspiciously self-inflicted. Not known the lines. Not known how to cut open. Go away, outsider. I'm not cutting you open, I'm stitching you closed. So please come down, we can do this without your moronic superstitions. Hmm. The one who did this to you, you definitely knew though. I mean, an impressive wound. 
was it one of you lot? Family business. Leave. Like hell, I will. You drag me here, so I'll see it to the end. Leave. Let die. If I die, then no wedding. If I die, few of us left. Wedding? Not yours, obviously. So why should you worry? No, not mine. What? Hmm. Cooking, just cooking. <laughs> um. An old one, you are lucky to have such a caring wife, Worm. Maybe he's not that... Enemy, spoiled everything! I'm touched, a patient's gratitude is the most rewarding thing a doctor can hear. Okay. So I saves him. And now they're going to marry. And this girl is going to get all his stuff, probably? What the hell? Oh, I got his heart. The wedding went well. This is for you. No declining. Is that the heart? That girl's? The one who danced? Not declining. She chose herself. She was bethrown to the earth. The wedding went well. Jesus. This is crazy. Um, you know what? I'm beginning to think the plague broke out here for a reason. I should have bother I, I shouldn't have bothered fighting it. Okay, M. So this this is done for. Uh, so she died. Great. J. Uh, I have a heart now. Oh, I have a heart now, so I can go to the tragedians, whatever, guys. Everything will be good now. We are grateful to you. How can anyone deal with you people and preserve their sanity? What happened? She was an herb bride. Brides join earth in wedlock so that others may live. It means no one else will die today. You are the doctor. We did this for you. Are you kidding me right now? Wow. So this is what kind of wedding you were celebrating. Why or why didn't I listen to the poor wounded guy? If there's, uh, if, if there'd been mourning, the celebration would have been cancelled. If the celebration had been cancelled, the earth would have gone unfed. Um, you don't care about your husband's life at all, do you? We fear neither pain nor death. One is immortal while the kin lives. You wouldn't understand. Yeah, it's Greek to me. Alright, whatever. The day is over. The day is over? Uh, what the hell? Well, I have a heart. Wait, I have a heart. I have a heart. Don't, don't stop yet. I have a heart. I hear crows, but I don't see any. Uh, okay, let's go to the to the uh, actors. Cause I have a heart now. Oh, there's no one left. Uh, great. Wait. Oh. Oh, there there are people left. Oh, sorry. I have a heart now. Let me let me get you heart. Where did these things come from? Sissy, what the hell is that? You know, let's talk to them. I, I have a heart. I have a heart. Excellency, it's so heartwarming to see you in good health. Here, I've taken heart. Taken a heart, I mean. Undoubtedly an open one. Oh, Excellency. What a sordid sight. Sorry for underestimating you. You definitely do have... How shall I put it? A creative touch. D uh, but this is pure madness. You can't take things so literally. It looked too fitting to be a coincidence. Calm now, Excellency. Calm now. Do you think this is some sort of game? Even if it is, it most certainly is not played by your rules. A game is a cage, and if you feel uh, if you fail to break out of it, you lose. We know what we're talking about. Hmm. You promised to help me out uh, with this evening's appointment. We just did. It's very fitting coincidence indeed. Uh. Okay. Please explain more clearly. Never accept to play a game if you don't understand its rules. The stakes are too high. 
if you already have challenge and change those rules Bachelor Dankowski challenge and change you buffoons you are both buffoons you're being stared at I'm being stared at by whom uh, so this is done I still have the crucible headquarters this and this so I'm done with these guys I still have something here I guess do I have to go inside? No. Oh, what the hell? What the hell? You are so into this. I am. I am into it. Yeah. We would kindly suggest that any unauthorized attendants move along, please. Sorry, but our workload is uh, tremendous. Who are you? We are here replacing the deceased, keeping tabs on the deceased, finding accommodation for the deceased. Taking complaints from the deceased. If you would like to file a complaint, please wait in line for your turn. I think I'm going insane. Thank heavens I'm still alive. I have no intention of dying. Every order and instruction of yours has been carried out with precision. We would accept no complaints in regard to ourselves or our predecessors from you. If you feel, if you feel dissatisfied with anything, you have no one to blame but yourself. Indeed, okay. So this one's finished too, I guess. I still have the shop and the house where the children are. This is screwed up. This is really screwed up. Like this, this, this is freaky. Let's go to the shop. I don't know what I have to do with the shop though. Um, what the hell is this? Was this thing before? Here before? Oh, the shop is closed. Why? Oh, I'm guessing this is death? Uh, what the hell? What's going on? What's going on? What are your objective and quest? Um... Well, I, I don't really have... An, uh, the objective, I think, would be to find uh, the plague. Uh, who's... who's uh, the shop. Who's... Uh, who's infected? Who the fudge are you? Orderly. Here it is, doctor. Here it finally is. You were right all along. So here we are, standing out watch once again, awaiting your wise orders. Okay. Um, do I hear the light in your voice orderly? No, we need to find a way to withstand the outbreak now. Perhaps someone will survive. Nothing is over yet. This is just the beginning. This is what I've been told to relay to you. By whom? Uh, to told you by whom? We deal in death, Bachelor. We have our own sources. Some of them on the other side. Uh, I'll make sure to thank them, whoever they are, as soon as I get there. Okay. So, so the shop is closed. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. Oh, this one's being fired up. P, what's P? Oh, my hunger, immunity went down a little bit, health went down a bit. Okay. What the hell? Just smoke? Huh. Choice as well. Um, okay, so the 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 objective of this of this mission, I think, is to find the pe the person who's infected. I didn't find it, so that's not good. Who the hell is this person? They're all wrapped up. What the fudge? Crap. Oh, uh, crap. Is this death? I'm standing my watch as per your instructions. My job is to educate the local populace of the required precaution measures. Uh, immunity is key. This is our main defense, our tough armor. As long as it's high, there is a chance to escape. Okay, only when unavailable. 
Okay, wait, wait, because there's so much text. The level of infection is decreased by antibiotics. Uh, but they're also harmful for your health. We forbid the populace from taking too much of them. Correction, there are problematic rumors circulating about some sort of magic cures. Um, if you insist, sir, we'll quell these rumors. Okay. What else? Immunity aside, thick cloning also protects from infection. Well done, as you were. Jeez, they, they all look the same. Everybody looks the freaking same. Uh, the drugstore. Oh, I can go to the drugstore, apparently. I got some water, food. Okay. Drugstore. So drugstore opened. Let's let's go there. Uh, what is that black stuff? I I have no idea. I have no idea. It's like just smoke. I I guess I'm I'm um. I I guess I'm just uh, losing my health. I'm dying. I think I'm dying. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. Uh, where the hell is the drugstore? Oh, it's all the way there. Uh, what? Health Not went down. Has come. Oh, fuck off, death. Oh, what do you want? No, no. This is not what I meant. This is not how you were supposed to die. Uh, is this based on a real story or place? I don't think so. No, Lurch. I don't think so. No, no, no. Um, why should I care? Just hard to please, aren't you? Think about it. Are you ready to die? This is what the question was. The warning is important here. You're dying, but you aren't ready. What's the point of such death? You never, uh, you never braved the abyss. You fell limply down with its chasm. Um, yeah, I agree that the attempt was lousy. Would you let me try again? Sometimes death is not the end, but merely a new beginning. See, this is from Effie. Does the black smoke hurt you? I don't think so, no. I don't think it hurts me, no. It, I think it's just, uh, you know, to showcase that I'm getting sicker and sicker. This loss was pointless. It teaches nothing. So, I guess... I guess I didn't do the mission, like, what I was supposed to do. Um, Pathologic, the Marble Nest, 2016. So, yeah, everyone, this, this has been the pre-alpha build of... Um, of Pathologic, the full game is going to come out sometime in the autumn of 2017. And please, game, don't just exit. I hope it didn't just exit. Oh, it did exit. Oh, come on, Jesus, game. Uh, but I kind of like it. I kind of like it. It, it, it is um, made, made by Unity, as you can see. It's made by Unity. And I don't know, I, I like the idea. I'm not 100% sure how... How the health works and everything, I think... I think I was supposed to be better prepared. Um, okay, so the thing is... Uh, yeah, the, um, the thing with... Um, death, the executioner, so death... Uh, takes a form, but it's not... It, it's just something there. It, it just takes a form of something that I know. Uh, that crow thing, that crow guy, whatever... Those are just costumes that I apparently designed for uh, orderlies so, so they don't get infected. So they can handle people and they can handle bodies that were infected, the people who are potentially infected and not, not get the plague too. So that, that was, that, that, that's a suit basically. That's a hazard suit, kind of like that. Think about it like that. And death just came under that form. You know, it doesn't look like that, it just came under that form. Uh, but yeah, everyone, this has been um, Pathologic, uh, the Marble Nest. It is a pre-alpha, it is kind of a... S um, kind of a, just a s small uh, story uh, to showcase you a little bit of the game world or, and, and, you know, of, um, of the game mechanics. It's not... Ev there's not everything there. But uh, I kind of like it, and, you know, if you're interested in it, you can play... You can actually play the original. Uh, this is um, a reimagining of, of the original game from 2005. You can find that one on Steam and on Good Old Games. On Good Old Games, actually, it's um, uh, it's what it's 
less than eight dollars. It's it's like 40, 44 percent off. Uh, this game though, Pathologic, this version uh, is going to come out in the autumn of 2017, and it's planned to come out on pretty much everything, like Windows, Mac OS, Linux, the PlayStation 4, and the Xbox One. And if you didn't know it, because I didn't know it when I first saw the game, this is an actual game that was uh, greenlit. Uh, sorry, greenlit. Wait, wait, quick kickstarted. Uh, it raised like over $330,000 back in 2014 so it's it's good to, to see it you know progressing and hopefully coming soon well soon well in in let's say nine months time nine ten months time that not exactly soon is it but yeah eventually it will come so yeah hopefully I'll, I'll get to play the full game too uh, definitely check check it out definitely check out the, the it's uh, it's um, a steam page because the video there I I think it's the, the official video, it's really creepy, like the video pretty much got me hooked on on, uh, on the game, I, I really like uh, the look and what uh, the developers are trying to do with it, it's pretty cool and this is just like a teaser. Uh, so thanks everyone for watching, uh, if you like this video or any other content that I put on the channel, like for example other live streams or gameplay videos, developer interviews, walkthroughs even, then please click on the subscribe button, uh, subscribe to Critical Habit for more gaming and Tell your friends, because sharing is caring and there's no plague coming to kill us all. Not yet at least. No, come on, this is definitely not. No, no. We're definitely going to be fine as long as we eat not gluten. If you don't if, if we don't eat gluten, we'll be fine. That that that's it. No gluten and we'll we will be we'll be great. We'll be fine. We'll survive. We will survive, hey! Sorry, I'm just going mad because I'm just going mad. Uh, thanks everyone for watching, uh, thanks everyone for commenting, if you like this video just like it, because uh, apparently that, that counts, um, I mean I like seeing likes, but it also counts for YouTube, so yeah, leave a like, leave a like, tell your friends, leave a like, tell your friends, and well, whew, have an awesome day, because I'll see you again soon, thank you again, have an awesome day, well, I'm definitely del delirious right now.